treatment, especially if it goes well this weekend on Sunday Night Football, considering they have two young electric quarterbacks. Now, one has proven himself in his first year in C.J. Stroud. Caleb Williams, a lot of eyeballs on him for the Bears. C.J. Stroud gave his two cents about the rookie. Definitely a playmaker, somebody who can extend plays and, you know, make all the cool throws. Um, tough, a tough player, um, take hits, um, and really just really talented. So, you know, I, I definitely do think that he has great things coming in his career. Um, and I definitely do think, like, he'll, he'll get his rhythm going. And, you know, it takes time. It's not something that doesn't happen overnight. It kind of happened overnight for C.J. Stroud, though, when he played for the Texans. I don't know. Uh, time for the Verizon Wake Up Call. Uh, Kyle, how much pressure does this put on Caleb Williams this weekend, knowing right across the foot from him is a C.J. Stroud that's been there, done that? Well, as we learned, Jamie, Caleb told us he does not feel nervous before <laughs> games ever, except for his first game when he was 13 or something like that. I'm really interested in the beginning of this game. Because I don't think Caleb was nervous for week one against the Titans, but I think he was tight, overjuiced. I don't know what it was, just too much electricity. If you watch the game, and I mean really watch it, not just red zone, there was plays to be made. He just overthrew guys. Like he overthrew Keenan once, he overthrew DJ once. Guys who had steps down the line, he just he just threw it five yards past them. That, to me, was a really young player being overexcited in front of the home crowd. Early on, if he starts doing that again, I'm telling you, you can't just rely on the Bears' defense and special teams to score four touchdowns. The Texans are too good. I want early Caleb. Calm down, calm down. You don't have to be C.J. Stroud. You don't have to be Joe Montana. Just be Caleb Williams or the most talented dude the Bears have had maybe ever. Complete some throws and settle in. Yeah, you know, Kyle, it, it really is going to take some time for him to get to that place where he can kind of just let it sizzle a little bit, let it marinate, get comfortable comfortable with the offense, get comfortable with the pressure, primetime television. Of course, you see the expectation of what C.J. Stroud did on the other side. Akbar, come here. <laughs> come here. Okay, there he is. Okay, good. <laughs> like what, what he did on the other side. But you think about he's going up against a defense that really didn't allow more than nine receptions mm. uh, with, the, with Anthony Richardson last week. And he's got a lot – to look for. I mean, that defense is going to get after after Caleb Williams in this in this matchup. He threw for 93 yards. I, I see, for me, an improvement is throwing for 150 yards in this game mm. and a couple of touchdowns and, you know, trying to get his team the victory. Yeah, I think for me, for, for Caleb in this game, the main thing I would say to Caleb is take what they give you. I think he got into a lot of trouble on Sunday where he tried to spin out of the pocket and he got sacked a lot because he was trying to do too much. So, for, for me, it's Caleb, play your game. Stay, stay within the, the yard markers. I think they're trying to throw the ball downfield a lot, but when they when they throw those little yeah. five yard slants, those little comebacks to Keenan Allen, when they they handed the ball ball off to Swift, they they had a lot of success. It was when they try to push the ball down the field too much that they came up with those incompletions. Now it's second and ten. Now you have to go deep just to get in there. So I really just want uh, Caleb just to stay in his place, stay in his little, his little world. I know it's going to mm. get a little bit more challenging with C.J. Stroud because C.J. is going to go do his yeah. thing. That mm -hmm. offense is going to put up points. And, and the Texans is a really underrated defense. And mm. so just, just stay he's, in he's got, yeah, stay he's got to stay There were a couple of those deep shots, though, that were wide open, and he just – Flat out missed. Yeah. So well, just like that's Kyle, the pressure. Yeah, Kyle, the pressure. Kyle just, I think he was really, really excited. Yeah. I think there was there was some angst there mm. that really pushed that ball, like that, that ball to Keenan down the sideline yeah. on that wheel route. Yeah. I think it just just calm down. Yeah. It's still football. Just do your thing. You'll be all right, 1-8. Like